Welcome back. We are here on Ether looking at the cryptocurrency market, and this is going to be my daily forecast for Monday, March 8, 2021. If you like to support our channel, you're welcome to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button to see our new videos, and you're welcome to join us over at Patreon. The link is down below. So we'll start by looking at, uh, at Bitcoin. Sorry. And uh, as you can see on Friday and basically the rest last week, we did have this rally and then broke down, rally again on Friday. Now on Saturday, it's basically not doing anything. Usually this becomes really uh, bullish in the weekend. It has been. Most of these massive runs to the upside have basically been in the weekend, on Saturday and on Sunday. So uh, yeah, it is a really quiet day. If you look at technical indicators, they are, well, they are kind of all over the place. The MACD is still under the signal line, we're still about zero, so we're still in an uptrend, but we're still just doing nothing really at the moment. Stochastic is crossing the signal line, that is very shine. The, the, Mac, the CCI is um, turning around, heading towards zero, that's also bullish shine, and the RSI is flat at this point. So technical indicators are not very much help here. If we manage to take out these uh, previous uh, highs, then we could head towards the all-time highs here. Break below the 20 exponential that opens the door to these previous lows and the 50 moving average. It looks like we're just uh, buying time here. We are, we have a um, trend line that we need to break. So getting close to breaking this trend line could signal that we are about to go higher. Get a rejection here that could be a sign that we are about to go lower. It could as well be that we are running into this corner and then we'll have a, uh, have a, um, I say whether or not we break to the upside or break to the downside. Uh, there is still a lot of optimism for this market, so I wouldn't be surprised if this rallied to the upside. So let's look at Ethereum. So this is a fairly bullish shine here on Saturday. On Friday, we rallied up towards the 50, and now we're testing the 20 exponential. Break about the 20 exponential opens the door to these previous highs. And uh, yes, it looks like we are about to run basically start a new rally here but we need to uh, cross the 20 exponential if we get uh, rejected here then we could head south really really quickly technical indicators are slowly turning around macd is still underneath the zero uh, so that's not a good, a good sign you're also underneath the signal line the stochastic is just at the signal line but is more bullish the cci is bullish and the um, rsi at the point point is bullish but a green candlestick above the 20 exponential that could open the door to the two thousand uh, dollar level so let's look at uh, cardano so uh, we did manage to break towards the 20 exponential rally and now we again are breaking down technical indicators for cardano are 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 bearish at this point so it looks like we're going to test the 20 exponential again that was not what I really expected. I expected a move similar to this and then continue the upside. But now we have tested the 20, rallied, and now we're breaking down again. And that is not a very bullish shine for this cryptocurrency. A break below the 20 exponential, that opens the door to these very lows and the 50 moving average. We can look at the Fibonacci retracement for this. And we can see that we ran into the uh, first support here at the first Fibonacci retracement. That's why we rallied. Break below this opens the door to the 50 at 0 0.88. And then all the way down here at 0 0.75 at the 50 moving average. So if this breaks, then this is going to be a complete tidal wave to the downside. So let's look at Litecoin. So very similar to... Um, to uh, Ethereum, we broke down, basically buying time here, uh, rallying, breaking down between the 20 and the 50 moving average. At the moment, we're at the top of, uh, we're testing the 20 exponential. Technical indicators today are, well, all over the place as well. Stochastic is flat, CCI is flat, no, MACD is flat, CCI is becoming bullish, and the RSI is flat. So it resembles the move that we saw here, where we where we went to the very highs here and then had this trend line. We basically rallied up towards this trend line several times. And then when we hit in the corner here in the, uh, in the 
50 moving week average, we just exploded to the upside. So this was a move uh, roughly from 128 all the way up towards 233. It looks like a very similar move here. It's just very a lot steeper, to be quite honest. So right there, there. We could be rallying up towards a trend line very similar to what we saw over here, where we rally up towards that and then down again, and then we'll take off at some point. If it doesn't seem like we are going to break down 50, we have tested it so many times, and usually when that is the case, it eventually rallies to the upside. But as you saw, what happened here, this could take a month, month and a half before it starts uh, rallying to the upside. So even though we get a rally from here, it doesn't mean that we will will see a move like this. We also saw that here, we rallied up towards half of this drop and then we broke back down. So we could rally up towards roughly $200 and then break down, down to the 50 moving average and then, and then continue that pattern. But 50 is holding really nicely and as long as that is the case, this should be expected to rally at some point. So let's look at NEO. So very similar here. We have this massive rally breakdown towards the 50. And now we're just sticking around here at the 20 exponential. Technical indicators, they are either flat or, yeah, or bullish. CCI is a little bit bullish, but the other ones are completely flat. Break below here, opens the door to the 50 at the 30. Two dollars uh, break above the 20 opens the door to these previous highs of 40 and then 43 and then to these highs of 54. So let's look at from. So we have broken the 20 exponential here. Uh, we are trading above it and have been doing that for the last three trading days. Um, Technical units are slowly turning to the upside. So this is uh, looking much better for this cryptocurrency than compared to the other ones. Um, yes, I wouldn't say too much because it has been really volatile and a break below the 20 exponential opens the door to these 0 0.04 and the 50 moving average is 0 0.0414. Otherwise, it looks like we're gradually growing, going towards 0 0.06. So, I hope you find this helpful. You're welcome to support, support the channel by subscribing. Hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos. And you're welcome to join us over at Patreon. Link is down below. Good luck and thank you very much.